My next guest is a huge hero of mine. He's probably best remembered for his many appearances on Parkinson. Will you welcome Michael Parkinson? <laughs> Bernard, fine time. You see, that's how lovely he is. He says hello to Bernard. <laughs> but you are... <laughs> you are the greatest chat show host in the world, aren't you? It's not saying much, is it, really? What's your secret, do you think? Uh, I don't... Flirting. Flirting? Do you ever flirt? No. No, <laughs> <I've> never. <laughs> I thought that, you know, they, they've been saying that, that there aren't any chat shows about. I think you're a marvellous chat show host, too, and... And I think that you and I could get together and produce some little chat show hosts. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love you, Parky. <laughs> but you know, there I'm were... growing to like you too. <laughs> <laughs> there are two men in the world mm. who I really admire, and one of them is you, Parky. And do you know who the other one is? No, go on. That lottery winner bloke. <laughs> He's well fed, isn't he? He is, isn't he? <laughs> but we all used to so much enjoy your chat shows. Did you enjoy doing them as much as we enjoyed watching them? Yeah, I enjoyed it. It's nice to sort of invite people on and sit down and have a nat, isn't it? You know, heroes Lovely, of yours and glamorous people and... Who know. was your favourite guest? My favourite guest, though, I don't know, it's a difficult... Emu. <laughs> Who said Emu? <laughs> Who said that? Are you a plant? <laughs> Bloody bird, I hate this. <laughs> Bloody emu. Well, who was really your favourite guest? Muhammad Ali. Muhammad Ali. Mm. We had Chris Eubanks, the boxer. Oh, bon on. chance, yes. And you know, it was going so well. And then I, against my better judgment, I mentioned that he'd lost his last two fights. You know? <laughs> He went all withdrawn. It seemed to hit a nerve, you know. <laughs> Is there anything you wouldn't like me to bring up, Parky? Uh, <laughs> a lot, but I guess that I'd say it's uh, without much of it not being brought up. Go on. <laughs> <laughs> but do you know who you never had on your show? Oh. would have been a, a great guest. Do you know who that was? Who? Oh. Me. <laughs> this is true. Uh, this is true. But, but you weren't around at the time, were you? I wasn't, no. You're a kind of late developer, uh, aren't you? Thank you. <laughs> so cheeky. <laughs> but, you know, sometimes there are difficult guests, aren't there? Mm -hmm. I can always tell when a guest isn't working, because, do you see Jean there? Jean, is she, does she go to sleep? In the second one. Hello, she Jean. She puts her anorak on. <laughs> 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 oh, she's got it on now. <laughs> I'm only joking. <laughs> But, you know... Is there any indication that when you get bored, I mean, do you start twitching or playing with your wristwatch or do your uh, eyes roll up the top of your head? I sometimes or... nod off. You do? <laughs> <laughs> and my corns start playing me up. I know when they're boring, when that happens. Mm -hmm. But tell me this. In the middle of an interview, did you ever completely forget who you were mm. interviewing? Mm. Who? Uh, John Wayne. John Wayne. <laughs> I knew that he had a nickname, which was Duke. Duke. I knew it wasn't Duke Ellington, that's for sure. I yes. didn't know that. Uh, and I could not... I thought, was it Duke Fonda, Duke? I went through the lot and I could not remember his name at all. So, we got through to the end of the interview without me mentioning his name at all. The same thing happened to me with Nick Owen. Do you know Nick Owen? Oh, yes. I could not remember why or what his name was or why he was there. And the thing was, he didn't have Anne Diamond sat there grinning, <laughs> you know, like the Cheshire cat next to him. And I completely forgot. I mean, people think it's easy, don't they, Parky? Oh, it's, it's but it's a, not. Oh, it's, you know, they don't know the kind of pressure you're under. No, do they? They, they don't. don't. No, they don't. No wonder your corns go in. <laughs> <laughs> people and I have on, I sit there chatting with them like I'm the best friend, mm. you know. If I saw them the next day on the street, 
I'd completely ignore them. I'd, I'd cross <laughs> over. Aren't we awful, Parky? Terrible. Do you ever make friends with people who've been on the show at all? No. You don't? <laughs> I think you'll be an exception. <laughs> <laughs> but you know something you used to do that I really used to admire? You used to ask a, a really personal question like this, and then you used to sit back with a simple look on your face, as if you didn't know what you'd done, like sort of that. You know, and, and I really admired that. Have you ever took naked pictures of your wife, Mary? <laughs> oh, I've learned from you, Parky, you I really did. have. <laughs> you did that very well. That's very good. But do you think there were more characters back then in the 70s? You know, you had Richard Burton on and, and Peter Sellers. We had to make do with Fred Talbot one week. <laughs> <laughs> and he was just as good in his own way. Were there more characters then, do you think, Parker? I think it was the, I think it was the, last, the last knockings of, the, of that great era of Hollywood stars. I think that's what we got in the 70s. And today's stars aren't mysterious anymore. They're not, are They're not. they? There's a, you know, you want to interview Clint Eastwood and I'm... <laughs> Sorry, Paul. You're Very unprofessional, though, wasn't it? <laughs> <laughs> You'd have never done that, would you? Quick hands. Uh, <laughs> have you? No, no, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> what were you going on about? I don't know. I've forgotten. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm, uh... The Hollywood stars. Oh, the Hollywood stars, yes. Hollywood. The Hollywood and I think, stars. I think that they, they were in those days, I mean, we were told Fred Astaire or Jim, J Jimmy oh, Cagney. Oh, Freddie Starr, I love him. Not Freddie Starr. <laughs> Freddie <laughs> Starr. Oh, Freddie Starr. Freddie Starr. Really? No, Freddie Starr. Now he's funny, isn't he? <laughs> he's just funny as Freddie Starr, though. No. no. Well, he's a good dancer, Freddie Starr, whatever he's called. You had him on, didn't you? Oh. Freddie Starr. Freddie Starr. Freddie Starr. Freddie Starr. We had Freddie Starr, yeah. yeah. No, you had him on. I had, I had him on many times. And what was he like? Freddie Starr. Yeah. <laughs> no, Freddie Starr. <laughs> <laughs> Fred Astaire, he, like? was, he was wonderful. I think the greatest star I ever interviewed. Why, really? Why? Hmm. Just because he was. But, I mean, to, to, to think that you were watching that guy dancing yes. like that, and that one day you might say, ladies and gentlemen, Freddie Starr, and Fred Astaire came down, I think. <laughs> I mean, Marvellous. But it's a lovely job being a chat show it host, is. isn't it's it? It is. It's a great job. You get to meet all these nice people like Chris Eubank. And... Yes. <laughs> did, he, did he get shirty with you? Do you know what's terrible? What? We interviewed him and then on the Monday later, he resigned from boxing. <laughs> <laughs> I feel so bad about it, Parkin. <laughs> I might do the same thing, I might resign from a human race. <laughs> <laughs> I might give it all up and go back to writing. Have you ever interviewed royalty, Parkin? I have. I interviewed Princess Anne. Princess Anne, mm. what was she like? Well, like most of Royalty, it doesn't give much away, no. Dorothy, no. You must try and get roles on this programme. Was... You no, know, I tried. Did I you? tried to. I wanted Princess Di in the first half, yeah. Prince Charles in the second. <laughs> and then I wanted to forge a reunion, you know, <laughs> something nice for the viewers. It would have been lovely. Perhaps the Queen could do the warm up. It would have been lovely, <laughs> wouldn't it? <laughs> you know, you've been sat here now for what, 10 minutes, something like that. And I've never once thought of my corns. <laughs> <laughs> That's how good you are. God bless you. Thank you. That's but you know, I've just thought of what? something what would be lovely. It would be really lovely to have you back in your rightful place in the interviewing chair. Shall we let him later and gentlemen? Yeah. Yeah. I've had... It suits you. You look <laughs> lovely there. It's the second she's all over again. So, Parky. Yes. Fire away. Fire away. <laughs> <laughs> Who's, who is it? What's been your most embarrassing moment? You have not lost it, Parky. <laughs> <laughs>